All right, so I bet y'all came in here wondering, how does Man's got a mascot in a Pro 1? Think about it. Man's is literally a Pro 1, probably got the game for Christmas, has, has played 2K for five days probably. Man's has a mascot in a Pro 1. Tell me why this don't make no sense. SS2 with an Elite 3 suit? Come on, man. Y'all might not believe me from the title and thumbnail, but this is a legit method tutorial. People have proved it, and I got the gameplay to support. Y'all see the pictures? Y'all might think they fake. Here's a live clip. See man's coming off the Legend helicopter. You know, you can only get this helicopter animation when you were Legend. Keep that in mind. He's got the Basketball Gods helmet that he didn't win in the Legend, uh, not Legend, Gold Rush shoot that he didn't earn, like I said. Pete Mans comes off the Legend helicopter and you're thinking, okay, you know, we got a Legend in the park, right? No, we don't. We got an Elite 3. Glitch the animation, glitch the suit, all that. Mascots, Elite 3 suits. Anyways, we are all over here with this tutorial. Stay tuned, man. We going crazy. Let's go. Let's go. Huh. Yeah. This is love. Or is it something else? I swear that you stay up in my mind. Yeah. Is this love? Or is it just something else? Alright, so here we are. The day has come. This glitch has been out for roughly 12 hours at the time this video is dropping. 12, 16 hours. I just seen this, record the video. Man's over here. Shout out uh, Mix Iso, by the way. He dropped this video. Hopefully, I'll leave his link in the, in the description. But if I don't, go check his channel out. Anyways, you see, he got this Superstar 2, my player account. You know, his rap is Superstar 2. He's got an Elite 3 suit. And this is raw footage. Look at this. This is not an edited screenshot. He's spinning around. He's painting his camera. You see, he got the elite suit. In this video, we're going to go over how to get the elite three suit and how to get mascots, etc. Anything you want, even event winnings. This is pretty much account transfer. So you can get anything that your player doesn't have or cannot unlock because of his rep on your player. So similar to last year's 2K19 glitch with the save wizard where you would transfer stuff onto your account. Um, this is pretty much the same thing, except this time it doesn't involve save wizard. This is actually much easier. And this time, Xbox players can do it too, because normally it was only a PlayStation thing. Here's footage from G Herb's video. Shout out G Herb. Go check him out. He's got 100K on YouTube. He was one of the first people to actually start making big moves with this video. But you see right here, this is a live clip from his video. You see he pops out with a mascot coming off of a helicopter, y'all. That's a legend animation. This is not just Elite 3 transfers. This is legend transfers. He comes off a helicopter. He is a pro one. And he's wearing a Benny the Bulls mascot. What y'all think about it? Y'all want to do this? Because I'm not going to lie. I have not done this yet. And I don't have proof of me doing it. Because I don't want to get banned. But I'm not going to lie. I might, I might have to consider. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I might have to consider. What y'all think about an Elite 2 running around the park with a mascot. An Elite 1. But anyways, man. Here's your raw footage. That's all your proof. So anyways, before I start going over it. This is the steps. So off the rip. Feel free to screenshot this and keep this. So as I explain this to you. You have your step by step. Your little manual right here. This is the screenshot that's been floating around on Twitter. This is how we do it. You're gonna sign into the account. You you do this, you do that. It's pretty much an account transfer, like I said. But anyways, man, be sure to take down the screenshot, y'all. This screenshot will help you if you don't understand what I'm saying, or if you just want your step-by-step -step manual of how to do it. You know what I mean? So there it is. And now we got footage from Young Dirk's video on a step-by-step -step tutorial. So Notice he has one person with the park events, the winning, uh, the winnings events, all that. You know, they have everything on their account. It is blacked out, but they sign into that profile, all right? So it's going to sign to that profile. It's going to hop on 2K. Step one, sign to the account with the winnings and hop on 2K. This is footage from Young Dirk's video, by the way. Check him out if you haven't already, uh, you haven't already checked him out. You haven't already seen this glitch. If you're coming here for me fresh, I appreciate y'all's support. But I did not figure this glitch out, so I do not want to take credit for it. Keep that in mind. So anyways, you sync the data, and you're on that account. You get to the main menu, and all you're going to do, and this is the next box, but this does work for PS4, is dash the game, and sign out of the account. All right? So you just synced into the game with an account that has the winnings. Now, you're going to sign into an account, your personal account, that doesn't have the winnings. So I should have probably made this clear already, but what you need is someone that has the winnings on their account similar to how the glitch the uh, logo glitch i showed y'all if you haven't seen that go check it out it's on my channel third most of you read on my channel go check it out um 
It's an account transfer. What I mean by an account transfer is that you have someone with the account with everything and you get it to the other account. So now he loads it on his new account and he loads the game and it syncs. It says you've been signed out on another console. He does that. He now signs into his account again to sync the data. Once again, if you don't understand what I'm saying, you have the step-by-step -step checklist that I showed y'all. Keep that by your side. I'm telling you, if you don't understand what I'm saying, you have that. So now he's on his account and he's going to quit the game again. But instead of just quitting it regular, like I said, this is a data account transfer. He goes to manage the game, go to his profile, and you clear the data. But what you want to make sure you do is you don't clear the data permanently. You never want to do that. It'll lose your account forever. Just do it temporarily. So now, as he loads the game back, just wait for it to load, you're going to notice here that we're going to have another sync. But this time, you're syncing the other account's data onto your player. And that's what makes everything happen. You see, you deleted your stuff temporarily off your account that you're on, but now we're resyncing. Here's the sync. Notice the colors changed. He's on his own account now in this gameplay. So you load the game with the synced data, and uh, here we are. Notice he gets the notification right here. It says, sign-in change occurred. You are now being returned to the title screen. So you're going to load the game, normal as it is, on your personal account. And automatically, once you load the game, I'll cut it real quick. Here you come on your My Player, and look at this animation, y'all. Here we see an Elite 3. Y'all will see it in a second, but we got an Elite 3 coming in on the helicopter with some event winnings and, and some, some kits that he hasn't won. He got the Pharaoh helmet. He got the Gold Rush jersey. He, um, yeah, man, I mean, he ain't earned it, but he got it now, and he's looking he's looking nice in the park, not gonna lie. See, this is how, this is how I'm trying to be, because you know what? I, I ain't got time to be playing the events, but I would love to have me a little Pharaoh hat going on. But yeah, you see him right here. And there it is with uh, his Elite 3 thing. And now, real quick, in case anyone didn't understand, I'll go over it one more time. So like I said, to break it down, every step by step you do one person with the events you take that account and i recommend going for a group post or finding someone on twitter people are probably paying to do this but you find someone with an account and you let them use it for you so here it is again to break it down he signs into the account with the winnings he is now going to load nba 2k20 and it's going to sync his data keep in mind this is a transfer a data transfer an account transfer i emphasize that because that is that is the method we're going for here we're switching everything from one account to another so he syncs data on the legend account right or the, the legend account the mascot account whatever account you're doing it with this one is a legend with event winnings so he does it off the rip quits the game and then we're automatically going to sign up so we're off the legend account that's all you need is to just load the game once with the legend account or the mascot account etc whatever it is you're now on your personal account loading the game and in order to do the transfer what we're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to temporarily clear your data which you see after right here he loads the game he syncs his data and when he syncs his data he's now loaded onto the game on his account but he's going to clear his saved data so it says you've been signed into on another console that means you're doing this right all right so now he clarifies who he is he's on his personal account now so now the accounts have been switched he's on his personal account after syncing data on his other one previously correct so now he has the ability to go to his account manage game same same system for playstation you go to manage your game or you go to your game settings and you clear your save data for your account so now by doing that you're gonna have to resync but it's syncing with the account that was originally signed in. That's the breakdown, y'all. This is how it works. This is the account transfer. This is how you transfer the winnings. Now, let me just put in a quick disclaimer. You might be watching this video three months from when it's uploaded and it might be patched. If it is, go check the description. Hopefully, I pin a comment saying this glitch is patched and you don't waste your time. Or you find out the hard way from somebody else or it doesn't work. Either way, and I also want to let y'all know, be careful. Not a lot of people are going to be throwing around Legend accounts or Elite 3 accounts. And if you have one and you want to try and, you know, make business, you know, you're going to have people charge to, to use your account. Just be careful with y'all accounts. Account transfers is never a safe thing. You do with people you don't know. If you know someone, then get it done with them. But you know what I mean? Just, just be safe, y'all. Anyways, so we got this the sign and change. We get the display. And now he loads the game with his true account after clearing the data. And look where we are. Once again, just had to go over it with again, break it down for y'all. 
that is the end summary of how to do it and you see now gold rush winnings pharaoh hat from basketball gods legend helicopter and he pops down and he's clearly visibly elite three he's got all his winnings y'all so that's pretty much a summary of how you transfer the account you get the data to display anyways man um it's been master on the store thank y'all so much for watching and i'm out peace you've been on my mind like all the time